You're watching a Nova video podcast on the DARPA Grand Challenge. There's uh, no substitute for the real deal. And the only way to win a desert race is to test in the desert. There's no way that we're going to emulate that uh, in a backyard in Pittsburgh. Today we're going to run the robot on a, a route that's what we expect the Grand Challenge to look like and we'll, we'll see how it does. We're hoping to drive about 60 miles today without having to intervene at all, just let it go. This is the, uh, by far Harvey's the most theory. dangerous road we, we've ever had the robot on. The, uh, the sheer drop-offs, the, the amount of rockiness, it's uh, pretty scary. <laughs> Uh, we uh, will take any risk that's called for to uh, get the performance. Uh, if something uh, cataclysmic is going to occur, our preference is that it happen now where we got time to recover. Come on left, buddy. <laughs> Please on, go left. We've been running all afternoon and uh, it went over some really steep hills and down them and really narrow roads and places where yeah, if it had made a mistake it would have destroyed itself. This, this is the best we've seen the robot run. It, uh, it was a really challenging course and it just it, it did real well. It kicked some butt today. For more on the Grand Challenge, visit us online at pbs.org slash nova slash robot race.